hello everyone and uh, welcome to another after effects tutorial in this after effects tutorial i will show you how to animate any object or any text along a path if you are new here don't forget to subscribe to my channel and uh, hit the bell so you don't miss anything i'm here in uh, google image i will um, search for uh, something to work with so let's say i'm looking for airplane top view png and then I will uh, choose transparent and you have to really find something transparent there this is transparent uh, image this is not yeah this is uh, transparent so save image now let's go to uh, after effects I will uh, hit file import file and I will bring my airplane now i will click on new composition or composition new composition i will choose 1080p i will make it 10 seconds and then hit ok now i will click on the pen tool okay to draw path so let's say i want to make something like this click and drag click and drag okay and don't worry you can uh, click on the vertex and uh, change them later on like this okay now i will drag my airplane to the composition now i will open the shape layer content shape one path one select the path you can hit ctrl c or edit copy now i will open the airplane layer transform position select the position and then edit paste or ctrl v so now we will have this animation to correct that you need to go to layer transform auto orient and then i will choose orient along path now it will follow the path let's run preview this it's not what we want to correct that we just need to rotate the airplane like this so now if we run preview it we can see the animation like this let's do some adjustment i will select the shape layer maybe gray and uh, I will open the shape layer open the stroke property and I will click on the dashes plus and like this you will get this kind of uh, dashed lines maybe I can select I can uh, open the opacity and uh, lower it to something like 50 maybe so we can see it better and maybe we can add a background right click new solid and i will choose a background put it down and this is our uh, animation of course you can do the same thing with uh, the shape layer for example if i choose any um, shape layer from this or you can draw let's say you want to draw um, an arrow so I will click in uh, pen tool and I will uh, make an arrow like this of course you can correct it so this is my shape layer I will choose uh, a color maybe this color now I need to change the anchor point to center okay let's hide this one for the moment and I will draw my shape of course you can disable this uh, field by clicking here and none so you only get this uh, this path again I will open this content shape one path one path edit copy and then I will open the transform for my shape layer 
and edit paste or control V I will make it smaller so scale it down like this and uh, again let's go to layer transform auto orient orient along path and now we have our arrow animated now when it comes to text we can do the same thing composition new composition hit ok so I will write my text here motion hub let's align it to center maybe bigger with the text layer selected click on the pen tool and uh, you can draw the uh, path something like this now we will open the text layer text path option and let's choose uh, mask one and automatically it will it will be there so we have uh, this um, properties we have reverse uh, path which is to reverse the path to the other side and uh, perpendicular to path which means it will put all the characters like this uh, there is also force alignment which will be which will spread the text along the path let's animate the text I will uh, click on the stopwatch next to the first margin or last margin move the current time to two seconds for example and then I will change it change the animation like this so now we have this animation you can add like something like a polygon we'll drag it like this and I will put it here now in the path option I will not choose mask 1 but this time I will choose the mask 2 and maybe it's good to change it to a reverse path again with the first margin go on the timeline and then move it like this so now we have this kind of animation if you activate the perpendicular to path it will be uh, like this you can play with the settings and uh, get a lot of uh, effects